Yeah, I think um, I think we'll both agree. Um, especially when Beth moved up, um, then that was probably at home. So obviously it took Beth quite a wee while to move up. Probably about it's about eleven months in total. Yeah. Um, but now obviously we've had this little one. Um, <laughs> obviously born in Edinburgh. Uh, Edinburgh's got a special place in our in our hearts now. Oh, absolutely love it. I think Scotland has got a good place in our hearts in terms of our interests. Like we absolutely love walking. Obviously Ben likes surfing. Like so being near the beach, being near the city. It's great. Um, obviously, we're quite far from family, but it's just an excuse for them to come and stay with us, which is really nice. People, people think that being a pro rugby player um, is just literally playing rugby, but it's a 24-7 it's a job. Uh, people don't see the, the behind the scenes and the mental energy, etc., and the mental toll. It doesn't just take on me, but also affects Beth and the family as well. So having things uh, like taking the dog for a walk, going surfing, uh, meeting our friends for a coffee, um, and like you say, we live out on the countryside a little bit and that really takes our minds off things. It means I can take myself away from uh, the busy side of rugby and really kind of switch off. We were both kind of brought up in like around the sort of countryside. Um, and I feel like we've got the best of both worlds. I'm not trying to sell where we live, but I think it suits us as a family to a T. Like we say, we love, um, we love our walks. Um, we love getting out in the country as much as possible. So to be able to kind of take ourselves out of uh, take ourselves out of the city is great and also be so close at the same time. It was, um, I was really taken back by being named as uh, co-captain of the club and um, like Edinburgh was, was a real special place in my heart. I kind of, when I came here, um, I kind of, I'd really, I probably lost myself in a little bit way of uh, where I was as a, as a player. Um, I hadn't played as much as I had after a, few, a couple of injuries and coming here was a, it was a new start for me and a new start for my family. and. I've really taken that in my stride and I, I love Edinburgh and I love the fact uh, where we are at the moment and what we're building at the club. Um, and obviously having this little one in, in the same sort of week as I was kind of named as co-captain and was a real special was a real special start to the season and I think as a club we're, we're real building and um, we're building something special. I know it sounds very cliche but I, I truly believe it with the squad that we're building as well. Yeah, I mean, it's a massive transition, obviously having Bo, Ben being named co-captain and then my transition from being obviously really busy role in the police, um, being at home a lot more. Mm. It's, a, it's a massive transition, but I'm absolutely loving it. Like being a mum, full-time job. Obviously, I get to see Ben a lot more, which is really lovely. As Ben was saying, we love our walks and things like that. So it's so good to just get out. Um, I will end up going back to work at the end of the year, but for now, I'm just enjoying as a family which is good to um, again like Gloucester Gloucester for us um, again has a special place in our hearts just because it's where we obviously met uh, obviously it was the first club uh, that gave me the opportunity to play professional rugby uh, where no other club did um, so I grew up there and started my professional career there and I've got a lot of good friends who are still there so to be able to play against Gloucester this weekend um, is going to be really special and I can't wait to, can't wait to go against them tomorrow.